Charlie here, how you doing well? I wanted to show you a riff today and uh, to my mind this is one of the greatest riffs ever. It's one of those that just gets you excited, you can't help but smile. Uh, I'm sure by the title already you've seen what it is. So uh, no mucking about today, let's just kick it in. So this is the riff to STILL THE NIGHT! <laughs> So there you go, still, still the night! You can't just say, still the night. You have to say, still the night! <laughs> Brilliant. This is great. I mean, uh, I'm sure John Sykes would mind me saying this is very Led Zeppelin based. Very much so. I hear Black Dog and the Immigrant Song in this. Uh, and it's in the rock and roll key of F sharp. If you want to write a cool rock riff, write it in the key of F sharp. So many mean... <laughs> That to to uh, you know what I mean a plethora of songs in the key of F sharp. So let's kick to it. Um, let's kick to it. Let's jump to it even. Um, so I'm gonna go for a bit of a close up so you can see my fingers and we can get this ditty down. So close up. Right. So in the key of F sharp minor. <laughs> shape one pentatonic um, but he's also using the flat five so in this case the C note or the blues note as it's called all right uh, let me just clean it up so you can hear it better so what we're doing we're going to start out doing two three four on the fifth string and then going to two on the fourth string so, and then we're going to go to that flat five note, the C note, uh, so the third fret on the fifth string, and pull off to two on that same string. So you got that happening. And then pull off to the open fifth string, the open A. to two again the fifth string and pull off to the fifth string again. Give me lots of second frets and third frets and open strings uh, going on with this riff. So that's so far. Then go up to the sixth string on the F sharp on the same fret, second fret, and pull off to the open six. Two on the fifth string, hammer on to three, pull off to two, open fifth string. And then back to two on the fifth string, open. And then two on the sixth string again, and pull off to the open sixth string. And then you go back uh, to the second fret on the sixth string, the F sharp and then two more and this is where the immigrant song um, kind of idea comes into play and then so after playing the F sharp the immigrant song bit go to the octave so F sharp on the full string full fret and then back to the low F sharp on the sixth string so you got that slowly And then we've got an E power chord, we're going to do a slightly different way what you might not have done before. I call this like the funky power chord. So we're going to do an E on the fourth string, second fret, B on the third string, uh, fourth fret, and a little finger on the E on the second string, fifth fret. Root and a fifth, but it's just uh, kind of a, a brighter sound as opposed to doing there. So you're on E power chord, and then a B power chord, which is your conventional power chord shape. So 
two on the fifth string on the root note, and then four on the fourth string with your third finger and little finger underneath on the third string full fret. Right. So. Then after that, you got two again on the fifth string, hammer on to three and pull off, back to two, and then open fifth string again, and then two on the fifth string, uh, pull off to the open fifth string, and up to the sixth string on the second fret, and pull off to the open sixth string. And then pretty much do that again. So two, hammer three, pull off two, Open fish ring. And then you're going back to the F sharp again and do that pick it twice. Right there. And then go to the octave octave on the um, F sharp on the full string. And back to the lower F sharp as well. Alright, so it's just the same thing repeating itself, which is nice and handy. You have to learn any new information. Different chords, you've got a B power chord as opposed to the E like last time. So, like before, two on the fifth string, four on the fourth string, little finger underneath, first finger, third, and little fingers. B power chord, and then A power chord. Open fifth string, two on the fourth string, and then two on the third string. And I'm barring that with my first finger. So, uh, everything nice and slowly. Slowly again with a little bit of dirt. So there you go, a nice quick uh, little lesson there on one of the coolest riffs the 1980s ever produced. Still of the Night by White Snake, John Sykes is a guitar player, awesome guitar player, uh, very big, big one. You know, wide vibrato and stuff like that. Uh, if you're interested, the guitar I'm using is The Beast, my Les Paul, uh, 2003 model. Some, I was quite nice when someone said uh, they thought it was a 1960s Les Paul <laughs> uh, at a gig the other day, but no, it's 2003 model. And the amp I'm using is a Black Star HT60, HT Stage 60, I believe the real term is it. Anyway, thanks a lot, I'm Mike Bradley, and um, see you in the next video. Take care.